All right. Okay, and we're up. Good evening. Let me, let me type that out too. Good evening. There. There. Now it's official. Okay, so welcome to the Friday night stream. Tonight we're going to be playing Clock Tower. And I'm going to confess right off the bat. I've never beaten this game before. I haven't really gotten very far. And so, consequently, I have no fucking idea what I'm doing. Hello, Ninja. How are you? So, we're going to be flying completely blind tonight. So, we're just going to see how far I get in this one. Because I have no prior knowledge of this game. Uh, I know it's a point-and-click adventure, and um, probably one of the earliest survival horror uh, entries ever. And hey, Jake, what's going on? And so, I don't know what to expect. And God fucking speak. Yeah, exactly. Um, I plan on dying. I don't plan on finishing this, and I plan on dying a lot. So that'll be interesting to see. But anyway, um, without further ado, we got enough people to continue the bet. So what do you say we get started? So here we go. And it begins. Welcome to Clock Tower. Yep. Hold up. Ah, there it goes. Okay, so... I haven't unlocked any of the endings, as you can see. So, we're just gonna dive right in. Welcome. Alright, so... A little bit of a backstory for y'all. <laughs> oh, hey, it just so happens there's only two days left in September. Laura, like, hurry up. We, like, want to be there before sunset. Okay, I'll, I, I promise I won't do that anymore. Miss Mary. Yes? From now on, what kind of place will we be living in? That's the fifth time you've asked! Okay, I promise I'll never do that anymore either. Yes, I'm sure it's very nice. Hey, what's going on, Sapien? Reading Moby Dick? Kind of slow going right off the bat. What a huge place. Just pan around, get everything. Give me every angle you got. Oh, yeah, baby. I have to go get Mr. Barrows. Oh, my God. I mean, you could tell by her profile picture that she's fucking evil. Look at that. I mean... 
Okay, so I guess she's gone. Uh, oh, oh, I just got control. So, um, oh, there's doot, doot. I'm gonna slowly walk over and talk to everybody. You wanna know what kind of guy, can, can I make this go any faster? No, I can't. Thanks for liking, Sapien. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, I didn't wanna to talk to her again. Shit. Oh, this is gonna be a long night, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, how do I talk to you? What is it? Is something wrong? Oh my god, is all the text gonna be like this? This house makes me uneasy. No, ah, uh, uh, god. Stop, just stop it. Can't judge a person by their cover. And speaking of which... Hello, Lot. Um, yeah, Lot's paranoid. Mm. Yes, ellipses. Oh, well... Can I run? Is this like my default walkie sp It looked like I was about to break into a sprint there for a second. The tingo scrap cock. Okay, I'm pressing buttons, but I don't see my walking speed improving any. Nope, she's just walking. Oh boy. I don't know, I think I may have made a mistake, everybody. Like for a second it looked like she was about to break into a sprint and then she just stopped. I hate this Wi-Fi. She walks like a bu- Yeah, she does. She really does. Alright, so I guess we just keep going. Can I not go any further? Mary, she's taking a long time. Yeah, so is this fucking prologue. Can we move it along here, please? Should I go find Miss Mary? No. I'll go look for her. Uh-oh. Okay. Whoa! The main hall. Oh, wow. That was fast. Come on, this isn't funny. Ellipses. Oh, now she can sprint. Oh, God, look at that. Finally. Okay, so the L and R buttons change direction, the sprint direction. Locked. Huh? Locked. Okay, so... No, you know what? Fuck it. I don't want to go upstairs. Oh, crap. Once you're locked into something, that's it, huh? Shit. Okay, looks like we're going upstairs. Sorry, folks. Here, I might as well see what's here, huh? No, other way. Thank you. Let's see what's out this way. Whoa! Okay. Yeah, it's a nice place. Apparently, nobody did an inspection of this home in quite a long time. Alright, let's just get back downstairs. We need to advance the plot. Violation. Yeah. 
something tells me this mansion's not up to code. Alright. Since that door's locked, there's only really one way we can go. Vroom vroom. see what's out here. Oh, there's something out here. <laughs> no shit. Oh, oh, I think I found something. I found my first clue. A pile of trash, wood, and concrete. Oh, I got a rock. Okay. Don't know what good that's going to do me. But whatever. All right. Start moving. Intro's over. <laughs> Dark up. Yes, we know. Come on. A little further along here. Let's go. Alright, so I guess we'll try this first door. Again, I have no idea what I'm doing, folks. The lights are out. Where's the switch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is a creepy ass painting. I see a box up there. Let's see what we got there. There's a key in here. Pocketed West Wing key. Okay. Is this the light switch? Let's see. Oh, there you go. There's light now. Okay, nothing but ellipses from that painting. If you could move a little faster, I'd sure appreciate it. Just a little. Come on, it's not that tough. I know you're in a spooky mansion, but... Let's just get on with it here. It looks like the left bed isn't used. It looks like the left bed isn't used, but I'm looking at the right bed. What's this? What is this thing? It, it looks like a photograph. Not sure what of, but whatever. What's this? Small bottle of perfume. Yeah. Hmm. It smells like Miss Mary's. Okay, so we're just picking up all sorts of items, but I haven't I haven't really seen anything spooky yet. What's this? It's like a parrot. What the Shit, it's attacking me. Let's get it. Boom. Got your ass. Okay, well. Achievement unlocked. I just killed a parrot. I smothered it to death. Now that that's over, what the fuck's going on, man? Okay, um, let's see what's in this next room. No, I didn't want you to turn the light off. God damn it. Open the door. Okay, so that just led me back out here. Whoa. Huh? 
Oh, that's not good. Spooky music. Whoa! What the hell is going on in here? Uh... Oh, hey, YOLO, what's going on? What the fuck's going on? You know what? I want nothing to do with this room. Fuck this. I'm out. Switch is broken. Yeah, I didn't want you to push the light switch, goddammit. No, don't go in there! Why are you going in there? I told you- Ugh. Fuck this. Oh, hey, Nicholas, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. Okay, we're done with that shit. Uh, is there any other doors in here? No, I guess not. So what's out this way? What the... What the hell? Oh, fuck! Well, I found one of my friends, I guess. Shit! The Scissorman! Yeah, fuck this, I'm out. Bye-bye. I'm gone. Uh, where the fuck do I go now? I've only found like... Oh shit, he just, he's, he's chasing me. Oh, how did he, how the fuck did he get there? Oof. Okay. So apparently I just died. The fuck's going on? Yeah, we're not going through that again. Okay, um, can I continue? Where does it start me if I continue? Oh, it starts me literally mid-chase. Alright, well, since he's out here, let's try going back in here. Alright, well, my friend's corpse is gone. Let's see if there's any place I can hide. I don't think I can defend myself against this guy. Huh? The door seems to be stuck. Alright, we'll keep moving. Ah! Oh, oh god, you're one of those. You trip in, during the middle of a chair. God damn it. Now where the hell am I? Okay, I have absolutely no idea where the hell I'm going. Uh, try this one. This is less encouraging. Oh, the picture's my health? Oh, fuck, I'm in the red zone. How the hell am I at the red zone already? Okay, let's try this room. Seems that the door is locked. Okay, so is he coming from that way, or do I have to... Running tires you out. Okay. That's also good to know. It's a good thing you're here, Nick, because I've I have zero experience playing this shit. I feel like I kind of screwed up really early on though, so. What are you doing? Ah crap, and there he is. Oh! Oh! I huh. No, don't turn on- don't turn on the light switch. Just get out of the room, you dumb bitch! Okay. Okay! Well, he's gone for now, so... Now that I have the run of the place for the time being... I guess now would be a good time to figure out where the hell I am. More importantly, where the hell I'm going. Wait, doesn't this look like the entrance hallway? Alright, so Nicholas, you obviously have some experience with this game. Anything out here? 
No, it's like a mirror image of the entrance. So we can't go that way. I might as well go this way. Okay, let's not run that much. Alright, so Nicholas, you're going to have to be my strategy guide for this one because I have no idea what I'm doing. There's a giant plank here. I obviously can't do it. Oh wait, can I do something with it? Just a simple plank of wood. Well, how about you grab it and... Uh, whatever. There are different endings. The important ones depend on who you see die. Well, um... Well, Scissorman skewered one of them, so... Okay, so if I can't go that way, I can't go this way. Yep, Anne's dead. We're obviously not going back in there, because that's where I left the Scissorman. He can pop out of anywhere, as far as I know. I don't think I had a time to check any of these rooms. Oh, crap. I'm getting tired. Now we're in. Oh, um, I'm guessing that was Laura, who was in the bathtub. Alright, well, since we're done with that. I have to say the controls for this game are very, very unwieldy. Oh, and apparently there's a phone call. Now, Laura is the only one you can save. Okay, so I got to do well not to run into her corpse. Locked. And what about that one down there? You know, check everything, lady. Well, that one works. Go in there. Okay, so... Baby girl, you need a shower. <laughs> I think she's fine. Okay, so now... What is going on with this? Some broken tableware. Why the fuck is the text moving? Various things are scattered around. Ooh. Okay, that box seems like an obvious trap. Nah. Ellipses, ellipses. Why is everything ellipses? You know what? Fuck this. That box is an obvious trap. I'm not falling for that shit. And apparently there's another box over here. Oh. At least I can easily get over it. Looks like a bird nest. Was it that parrot I killed earlier? What's that? What did I pick up? Oh. Well, that was smart. Great, so I agitated a crow. All right. I don't want to pull out a strategy guide. At least not yet. I've only died once so far. Let's go answer that phone. It's about 10.50, Yola. Okay, no. Let's go downstairs.
Sorry, it was just really slow for me. Figured I'd speed things up a little bit. I've already been through that door. This is the only one left. Oh no, there's two. It seems that door is locked. Well, don't you have a key? I mean, for real. Tap the hell of what you have mapped to be. Okay. Raged hella bad and cracked my screen. Forgot to put my battery back in. Okay, so tap B. Don't tap Y. Got it. What's in here, I wonder? There's something shiny here. <gasps> Whoa, what the hell? It's bugs! I think it's time to get out of here. Don't, don't. Ah, oh, god damn it. I should have hit L. Run out of the room. Shelly Duvall, you mean? That was a bust. Where the hell is that phone? For real. I keep hearing a ringing telephone, but I don't see anything. if she's in there. Okay. No. No. No, no, no. Fuck everything about this. No, I didn't. No, get back out. I think I know which way I need to go. We got that west wing key. I think we need to go back uh, where we begin. Oh, there's my inventory. Rock, perfume. Okay. So A is my inventory. Yeah, and yeah, X makes you come to a complete stop. B doesn't really seem to do much. So whatever. We'll just... Uh, we'll take a nice, slow, leisurely pace. Courtyard outside. It's dark 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 outside. There's a courtyard outside. I've already been outside, so it doesn't really matter. B saves your life. Apparently, it does. Okay, so now we're back out here. The karate and bicycle kick, Luke. First off, it's Liu Kang, but no. As far as I know, you're completely defenseless as far as this game goes. All you can do is hide. It's like the precursor to uh, Amnesia. Or Outlast. Huh? Locked. Don't you, don't you have that key? Okay. Well, I'm completely lost at this point. It only took me, what, about half an hour? Okay, 
I am so sorry. I can't deal. Okay, there's nothing that way. Any other way's collapsed. So all I can do. Can I borrow $155? Fuck no, you can't! Uh, no, it is not, Nicholas. Again, YOLO. No, the fuck you can't! Not enough to give you $155. You're on your own. I got bills coming up, man. Okay, so now comes the fun part of most survival horror games. Figuring out where the fuck to go. Now we're back in here. Didn't I? So real quick, the box next to the nest can be moved. You have to free a crow in a cage, and you have to have a piece of ham on you. I'm guessing I get the ham from that pantry with all the roaches in it. Okay, so we'll have to retrace our steps and head back there. Um, I did free a parrot from a cage, and I ended up covering it in uh, blankets. Sorry folks, I'm going to be doing that a lot just to speed things up. Yeah, see? I got it under the sheets. Now, am I supposed to do anything with that or no? Because that parrot, I'm pretty sure, is suffocating at this point. So it brings me back out here. So let's go back to that pantry and see if we can pick up some ham. I'm still in the red. And that phone is driving me nuts. I gotta find it. I don't know where it is, but I gotta find it. No, he's not a clown. At least not as far as I know. Door seems to be stuck. Where the fuck was that pantry now? Oh wait, I remember where it was. We're totally going the wrong way. Yeah, I figured leave the parrot. Just hold X and the speed button. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay. Alright, well now I'm learning shit about this game, which is nice. Because I never got far in this because I thought it was just confusing as fuck. And where the hell is the phone? Yes, it was, YOLO. Yes, it was. Alright, let's try I think it was back this way. I'm just hoping the roaches aren't still there. And I think this was where I trapped him. Some cute quick time events can only be survived with full health. Okay, so here's the pantry. Oh no, is it gonna. God damn it, not again! 
Can I at least get the shiny thing? Oh wow, that my health just drained really fast. Holy shit, that brought me that back down to the red like in no time. Okay, we need to get out of here. Okay, so shit. Well, at least I know I can heal myself, but at the same time... Ugh, I really need to figure out how to get that ham. So staying in here is no... is no bueno. So let's get out of here. That is going to drive me insane. You need insecticide to get the ham. Okay. So we'll have to find some insecticide. Don't know where we're going to find it, but we'll have to figure it out. I apologize if the stream is slow going. It's just me stumbling around in the dark. But it's nice to have a lifeline. Could have sworn we picked up a key. Found in cabinet room. Okay. Well, it's obviously not here, but we're gonna check it out anyway. I don't think I went it. I don't think I went back here. This feels like a trap. Some broken tableware. Various things are scattered. Okay, so this obviously is not the cabinet room. Boring. I actually went and had dinner with my folks. I know the Rickmobile was down at Tate's tonight, but I got out way too late. People are already camping out outside at like 2.15. Speaking of which, Jake, did you guys go down there? I know Rob was down there, but I don't know if you and Claude have got a chance. So it's not back there. Okay, stop. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, use the West Wing key. Didn't I come out of here? Not in that traffic. Okay. Alright, I was wondering. Okay, the cabinet room is on the second floor. Am I going the right way? Doesn't feel like I'm going the right way. I feel like I screwed up again. Now we're back in here. Cabinet room is on the second floor. Okay, so we'll try all the doors. not. I can go in here. Uh, it feels like someone's watching. They probably are, so what do you say? We don't waste any time, and we just get the hell out of here. How about that? 
This is not the fucking cabinet room, is it? This looks like another room I don't want to be in right now, so what do you say we get out? So now we're back out here. Alright, so... This is obviously not it. Oh! There's a staircase leading down, I didn't even realize. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I know where we are. So I think I'm back on the first floor now. Maybe. Hey, it's another bathroom. What the hell was that? A cat. Okay, wonder what to do with that cat now. You know, let's find that insecticide first before we do anything else. Says you. Okay, this is the piano room. There's only junk inside. Okay, well, I found the piano room, but I don't want to be in here either. My Halloween's gonna be awesome. You can get the ham from the fridge in the meat room with the bugs. Yeah, but don't you need the insecticide? Oh, I guess I can't go any further. It's not the locker with the bug, it's the fridge and the meat room. Oh, it's the fridge! Okay. So if I go in the locker with the bugs, okay. Excuse me. Am I gonna, gonna go to a bar and hit on some chick? No. Nope, going up to New York on the 20th. So FYI, I will not be streaming that night. It's gonna sound stupid, but the ham will save your life. Okay. I'll take your word for it, Nicholas. is this now? I have no idea where the fuck I am. You know what? I'm gonna take a breather. Okay, we're back. Hamming it up. Yep, that's exactly what we're doing. Scare incoming. I don't see one.
I know my friend Rob has, but I haven't. Alright, so there's really no point in me being down here. So what do you say, whoop, we go back up. Ah, <sighs> oh, fuck, another place where I don't know where I am. Alright, let's get out of here. Yes, let's definitely get out of here. I don't like those bubbly noises. So I think... Yeah, through here. Oh, okay. That phone's gonna drive me nuts. Anyway. No, other way. Other way. Thank you. I think it was back here, if I remember correctly. So it was in this room. Yes. Okay, so you, it's in the fridge. A ham was put in here. Picked up some ham. Okay, cool. Alright, so now we got some ham. What the hell do I do with it? Wait. I have the strangest feeling I don't want to be in here. So what do you say we get out? So move those two boxes. Okay, if I can just find where those boxes are, I think I gotta go back upstairs. Right? Am I crazy? Don't answer that. Stop. Get on your knees. Let's get some health back. There we go. Okay. Stairs all the way to the left. That's what I thought. And it was either this door. No, this one's locked. So it's this one. It has to be. Bingo. Okay, so it's this one we have to move. Nothing is inside, nothing is inside, nothing is inside. I got a rock, some perfume, and ham. Oh, there we go. Oh no. What did I just do? No, don't stand on top of it. Choose the ham. Oh, I said the bird nest. Okay, choosing the ham does nothing. Put it on the box, okay. Oh! Wow. 
Well, thanks, Jake. What is this? The nest is full of eggs and junk. The nest is full of eggs and junk. Okay. Now getting the stick does nothing. Besides, I already did that once already, and that really pissed it off. Didn't seem to do much, but it did a lot. I'll take your word for it. We'll check it. All right. Checking the nest one more time. Nest is full of eggs and junk. Yep, that's the only thing it gives it gets me. And in the other room, once the other the other side, check a box for a black cloak. Black cloak, you say. All right. In the other room. In here? Ellipses, 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 ellipses. Broken tableware. Oh, oh, no good, too high a climb up. Well, there you go. Simplest solutions are often the best. A lot of weird puzzles in this one. some clothes here. What kind of clothes are these? Picked up a black robe. Oh, so it's a black robe. Okay, so now I have that in my inventory. So now I can dress up like Dracula. Or maybe Mavis from Hotel Transylvania. Who knows? Okay, cool. So I got one part of my Halloween costume. I'm not pretty sure I'm playing Clock Tower, not Trick or Treat Adventure, but whatever. So what do we got? So I got a black robe, some ham, some perfume, and a rock. This is the worst Halloween ever. Okay. On some Harry Potter shit. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so now that we're done with that... Is Castlevania a good anime? Yes, it was very well done. I would highly recommend checking it out if you haven't already. All right, well, first thing I'm going to do is kneel. There we go. So I've only encountered the Scissorman once. I haven't seen him since, which is kind of weird. So at this point, I have no idea where I'm going. Not sure if I was supposed to go back downstairs, but whatever, here I am. I don't know what the hell happened to Anne's body, but... Now I have a black cape. Mm. 
No. No, I'm not. I'm about, I want to say, 50 pounds overweight. That's right, I'm, there's no, oh, what's this? I didn't see this before. There's a deep crack in the wall. It's crumbling. Uh, you know, I tried that, YOLO. It, it didn't work for me. You're yoked. I am 100% lost now. Needs the insecticide while I was in the room with the black robe on the floor. It looks like it can't. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. So I gotta go all the way back there. Fine by me. I will confess, this is the furthest I've ever gotten in this game. Wrong way. You have to try one... So it was in here. On the floor, it looks like a can. I see a lamp. Oh, is that it? A can of insecticide. Picked up some insecticide. Oh, okay. Can I pick up both of them? No, I can only pick up one. Okay, cool. All right, so we got that. Okay, so. I got the black rope. I got insecticide. I got ham. Perfume and a rock. Wow. I just noticed it today. I need to find that phone. That's going to be the whole theme of this stream right here is finding that fucking phone. All right, so that means we got to go back to the meat room again, which is not here. It's not in the West Wing. So we got to go back this way. <laughs> Who was phone? Anybody remember that meme? Physician, heal thyself. Okay, so now we got that going on. So it must have been in here, if I remember correctly. Yes, okay. So... So we're just gonna spam the shit out of it in here. Spam it on the cabinet. Spray the insecticide. Die, all of you. Burn in hell. A key is left behind. Pocketed the gold key. Alright, well. This is cool. Alright, so now that we got that, let's 
Starship Troopers, man. The only good bug is a dead bug. Remember Buenos Aires. Everyone fights, no one quits. Except for this chick. Bottom floor door, top left, check the goblet for silver key. Wait, did I just go the wrong way? Yeah, I did go the wrong way. Bottom floor door, top left, check goblet for silver key. the phone goblet for silver key part of me wants to check out that suit of armor seems to have been recently used some of the drink is still in there hmm hmm silver key is under the glass pocketed the silver key All right well since we finally got here what do you say we answer that phone? Huh. The phone line's been cut. Huh. The phone line's been cut. Okay. Various beverages. YOLO, you've told us that story already. Okay, so it's just there to be annoying. Okay, so now the silver key is mine. Now upstairs to that door you couldn't open. You mean the one that was stuck? in here. I know what you're talking about now. Use the silver... Okay. Whoa. The fuck's going on in here? Adherence? The clock tower's clock stopped. There's a note here. Hi, Evie. And clock towel. <laughs> okay, so read all the books and then push over the cabinet. So are you guys back in Florida, Evie? Or are you still up in uh, Georgia? Excuse me. Tower's clock stopped. All right. 
right, so click the wall. Yeah, let's see what happens here. The mural covers the entire wall. Part of it is hidden behind that shelf. Ellipses, ellipses, ellipses. Okay, cool. Okay. That just opens the door. Silver key. No, that just opens the door. Something to do with the candle? No. Ellipses, ellipses. Various chemicals are on the desk. Yeah, the thing is, it won't let me push the cabinet. Once I go up here, YOLO, my computer would explode if I tried to play Hellblade. That's not happening. And she just walks out of the room. Evie, I have no idea where I am right now. Uh, Nicholas has been acting as my guide for most of this game, and it's through him that I've been able to get this far. So, but at this point, I'm kind of not sure where I need to go next. So, I think I'm just going to have to explore this mansion for a little bit. But first, I'm going to take a rest. There we go. Portrait's blue again. <laughs> Yeah. Evie, so far I've only encountered the Scissorman once. Is there anything this way? Nope, just a wall. Yeah, it says here she was based off of uh, Jennifer Connelly. And not off of Shelley Duvall. Oh. Anyway, gotta go fast. There we go. I tried playing it one night on Friday, but I couldn't do it. For some reason, it kept crashing. Okay, so we're gonna try. You know what? I'm gonna go back to the main foyer. And, uh, next location should be upstairs. Uh, actually, in the room I just left. He came in through the stained glass ceiling, riding one of my dead friends all the way down. So that was fun. And he chased me all the way through the house, all the way to the second floor, and I just pushed a bookcase on top of him. I don't think that's gonna happen, sir. I'm not gonna try it again tonight. I'm gonna try and get as far as I can in this, and we'll see what happens. 
I have one other game I might play depending on how I do. Okay, so upstairs. Yeah, she's getting tired. Should probably heal myself again. You know we have to free the crow. Yeah, he hasn't shown up since. A home was total trash. Alright, you know what? There we go. Now you're healed. So... We have to free the crow, key to its cage should be on the meat hook. Well, we got the gold key, but we haven't figured out where that goes yet. Yes, because she walks extremely slow. And for the sake of time, I'd rather just zoom up the stairs. Alright, so we'll try in here. What the hell is in here? I don't think I'm in the right place. What's in here? Apparently nothing. The hell is that noise? gonna get out of here because fuck everything about that room okay what else we got to deal with uh, wait no you said upstairs so back up we go Whoop. should be coming up okay so if it wasn't the room with all the severed heads and jars it must be in here no that's where I came from okay so now we have to go this way run 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 come on come on come on come on come on Come on, sprint. Okay. So you can't go in that one. It won't even it won't even let me select it. Let's try this one. Uh, I see something in here. Play video games, obviously. This is a French doll. It's hung from the ceiling. It's a big clown doll. Yeah, fuck everything about this room. What do you say? We get out of here. Might need to mash B here if a doll floats at you. So far it hasn't, so. There's nothing in there. 
So now we're in this room. And I never fully explored this one. So let's see. Whoa. There's a pool in the courtyard. Can I search the desk? The desk is dusty. Okay, so that's a no. Ellipses, some books. That doesn't help me. Portrait of a middle-aged woman. May have to move the cursor on the knob. Okay. Alright, so we'll try that. Sounds like a good idea. Alright, here we go. Okay. Oh, don't turn the light on. The switch is broken. Yeah, I kind of figured. Let's just get out of here. Okay, so moving back. So it's here. Nope, I got nothing. It will not let me click on that door. Oh, so you're going off of the first fear. Okay. So, that might not work. Okay, so that door just might be sealed permanently. Which does not bode well for me. But anyway, I'm going to have Jennifer here take a nap. Hypernap, there we go. No, I didn't tell you to run. Stop running. There you go. Okay. I definitely need to figure out what I need to do next. Okay, so good news, bad news. Okay, give me the bad news first. What's the bad news? Get any bee because you scared off the crow from the nest with a stick. Okay, so that's the bad news. But you don't have to free it now. Okay. Oh my god, you walk so slow. Okay, then that one. Yeah, no, no, no. Fuck this room. Let's go downstairs, see what we can find. Let's see what's in here. Oh, right, the fucking doll room. No thanks. Bye. Nope. Fuck everything about that, too. Okay, this takes me back here. But I don't know where this leads. Oh, yeah, I do. It leads back to the first floor. Because I remember this. This is the stuck door. The door seems to be stuck. Yeah, there. Go. So now we're back here.
optional scares in the hanging doll room. Next thing to do is try and move the plank. Which means I gotta go back upstairs. What's out here? I forget. Oh, it's this room. What the hell's out here? There's a car out here. I, I can get into it. The keys aren't here. Okay. This is a key. A car key. Pocketed the car key. Alright, well, fuck it, since I have the car key. What do you say we get the hell out of here? Fuck that. Keys aren't here. Wait, don't... Okay, use the car key on the car. Try it now. I can get out of here with this car. Don't drive off. But the others. Okay, well, it looks like she talked herself out of it anyway, so. No, apparently she talked herself out of it, so we're all good. But fuck it. It's, I don't know, part of, I know I'm not supposed to, and it's probably going to lead to a bad ending, but. Do it if you want, but you'll get ending H. Alright, let's get ending H. What should I do? Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Boom! Oh, fuck. <laughs> fuck everything, we're done. <laughs> so, we got ending H. She's probably hiding in the back seat or something. Probably following horror movie trope number 1785. Dan and Bobby. Like I said, they're probably, it's, he's, my guess is he's probably hiding in the back seat. There's no way I could have got off this easy. Nicholas is right. This, this feels too easy. I totally can, Evie. There you go. I figured. <laughs> the Scissorman!
figured that would be the case. Yeah, we get it. So now, quick start. Oh, I guess that was quick start. Oh, it starts me with everybody gone now. Okay, well, knowing what we know now, what do you say we find some stuff? So the first thing I want to do, obviously, is to get the rock. Just use the box instead of the six stick. All right, I'll keep that in mind, but I might end up doing this. I might end up finishing this another time. So. For right now. There we go. All right, so what else do we have that I can play for tonight? What's something spooky? Spooky SNES game. I could do Demon's Crest, but I don't want to. It would take too long. Earthbound. Nah. Front mission. No, not scary. Nope. Play Amnesia. I'm not going to play Amnesia. Metal Warriors. Robocop versus the term Bubsy. Yeah, that's fucking scary. <laughs> Run Saber. No, nah, it's got to be something Halloween themed. Something at least Halloween themed in some way. Space Ace. Space Mega Force. Uh, Super Ghouls and Ghosts. Monster Party. You know, I could play Monster Party. You know what? But there is one... There actually is one game I want to play. And I think I just passed over it. Hold on. Hold on. Aha! There it is. I found it. I totally found it. Alright, here we go. Get ready for this shit. Yes, Nicholas, it is. Yolo, shut the fuck up. Next game for the night, welcome to Nosferatu, aka Castlevania meets Prince of Persia. So anyway, we're just 
just gonna jump right in. So anyway, this guy's girlfriend gets kidnapped by a vampire, so what does he do? He just walks straight into the dude's castle. The guy left the door open for him and everything. And you know how this song and dance goes. Trap door straight into the dungeon. She is technically home alone. Oh. My home alone, my uh, my home alone alone. My. <laughs> God, my, my vanilla ice alarm is just going off constantly tonight. That's good. Thank you for whoever subscribed. I'm not looking at OBS right now, so I can't tell who it is, but thank you. I think there's some more extra life out here. So it pretty much plays exactly the same as Prince of Persia. If you played that game, you played this, except there is no time limit for this one. Actually, there is. Whoop. Let's get out of here. We'll play this one for a little bit until I die. And then we'll move on to something else. I'll probably end up playing Monster Party for the rest of the night. Whoop. Now get in here. Good thing I remembered how to slide. Oh! Those are instant death. I do not want to get hit by those. I don't know what those red crystals do. Gargoyle bastards to get rid of. Oh, God, I forgot about that thing. Must be a slow day for Dracula. Just one woman. I thought he slaughtered villages. Keep forgetting about that thing. Oh. I don't know what those red crystals do. Oof. I think it's because it's modern day. Nobody really comes out to his neck of the woods anymore. Transylvania's not as happened as it used to be. Whoa, 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 what the hell? Alright, well, at least they got more life. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be enough. So... Oh, we're outside. I think the red crystals just let you absorb a hit. So 
What do I got waiting for me out here? Yeah, exactly. Oh. What am I fighting, Igor? Whoa! Y'all be having none of that right there, thank you. Shit, he's a werewolf! Okay. Whoa! Oh! Good night! <laughs> I don't know who this guy is. He punches werewolves for fun. Anyway, that was stage one, apparently. Oh. There's the welcoming committee. Anyway, here's stage two. Whoa. I gotta say, I'm digging the music for this. that sometimes we gotta slide under it Whoop. nope ow damn this thing's kicking my ass And that's it for me. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna continue. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> so that was Nosferatu. Apparently I don't know how to get rid of those eyeball monsters, but what have you. enough of that I think um, it's a good question though do I have monster party do I have monster party that is a good question I know I own the cartridge but let's see what do I got in my bag of tricks here Nope, it's not in this list. But since I'm here, there is one more thing I do want to play. Maybe, we'll see. Yes. Maybe? Hold on, guys, I'm trying to figure something out. Punch the eyeball in the eye. <laughs> All right, let's see what's going on here now. Ooh, uninvited. I haven't played that in a long time. Part of me wants to play an old text adventure, but I want to get a group together for that stuff. Same thing, there's an old Commodore 64 game as well called The Trivia Monster, which is a lot of fun, but... Give me one second, folks. I'm actually going to mute this for a second. Play something good. Yeah, we'll see. Is it 
it still exist? Yes, it does. Okay, cool. Just a few minutes, guys. We'll get this rolling. There we go. Alright. Oh, where is it? There it is. There you are. In you go. Okay. So now then. Now that we got that taken care of. The suspense man. Pick something. Well, I had to I had to find it first, you know? You can't rush greatness. So anyway. Oh yeah, let me put that back on. That's important. Since you got since Nicholas asked for it, we're playing it. Welcome to Monster Party. This will be the last game we play for the night. But it's one of my favorite games of all well, not one of my favorite games of all time. But it is up there. Me and my cousin, uh, my cousin introduced me to this game, and we spent an entire night trying to beat it. So what is this YOLO? It's amazing as what it is. The worst monster of them all, fried shrimp, exactly. Oh, it gets better. So anyway, we're just gonna dive right in. So it's story time. Mark was walking home from a ball game. He looked up and saw a bright star. <laughs> While he stared at it, his fucking retinas melted. God, the sun went nova. It's the onion ring. <laughs> Mark of fire. Hello, everybody. In front of him. But a pterodactyl. Yeah, exactly. Mark quickly asked, Who are you? <laughs> you know, because in this universe, if a giant fucking pterodactyl landed in front of me, I wouldn't just run away screaming. What's up? Ah, nothing much, man. I, uh, I was just trying to score some, like, burgers or something. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm like 10, dude. <laughs> I'm afraid to fight the evil monsters. <laughs> You'll be able to destroy them easily. Anything is okay. Anyhow, let's go. It's stranger danger. Hashtag stranger danger. Exactly. <laughs> so. Whatever. He whisks him away to a faraway land. Have fun filing those missing persons reports, Mom. <laughs> My planet is dangerous. And yet you're taking me straight there. Must act together. How? Like this, he said. Then they fuse together. This is how Mark's adventure began. Round one start. Here we go. Welcome to Happy Land, filled with uh, flaming school children. Because when I think happiness and sunshine, I think Japanese school children on fire. Alright, I'm getting impatient. 
And it's dead. Alright, so that's one boss down. So the object of each level is you have to fight a number of bosses hidden in doorways. And uh, eventually, it will give you a key once you defeat all of them. And that's how you exit the level. Really nothing more to it than that. Of course, magic drugs transform you into Bert. You can actually shoot laser beams from his eyes. Why he needed Mark in the first place, I have no fucking idea. But here we are. Try and get some more life. Is there anything in this smiling doorway? Empty. Okay. Oh. But I got 10,000 points. Oh, jeez. Enough of your crap. Yeah, keep healing and keep going up. Uh-oh. I'm coming down off my high. Please don't drop me in the air. Okay, good. Here we go. <laughs> Sorry, I'm dead. Nothing I had to do with that. Oh! Fabulous secret magic drugs make your problems go away. Alright. And here we go. Everybody ready for this shit? That was the only time that ever happens in this game. So this is what you're getting from this point on. Anyway, please don't pick on me. This guy takes a lot of hits. But at least I got the key. Oh god. Somebody give me health. This sucks. I, mean, I know you get bonus life at the end of each level, but still. Just a nice little boost. Just, just one heart. You know, that'd be, that'd be okay. No, nothing. Bastards. Getting me that easy. Oh, great, a question mark. Three points. Whoop the goddamn do. Yolo, it's gonna change colors between each stage. Come on, all I gotta do is make it to the goddamn door! Yay! level one. So thankfully you get bonus life at the end of each stage. Anyway, time for round two of the sewers. Yes, give me health. Let's mix it up! Alright, Medusa time. Funnily enough, she shoots slugs, which doesn't make any sense, really. Let's see if I survive this. Fish face on legs! Exactly! An 
alligators that shoot their own tails. There we go. That is the cool thing about the bat, is you can deflect projectiles. Bert can't do that. to me. Oh, uh, whatever. Oh, we're back to, we're back to Mark now. That's not entirely bad, though. Like I said, you gotta fight a number of bosses in each stage, and then that gets you a key. Once you get that key, you can beat the st you can leave the stage. I'm tweaking out! Okay. I got laser eyes, and I don't know what you're thinking. Comes as no surprise. Christmas like the blanket. Fairly easy. If you know what to do. If you're Bert, he's cake. Extends all the way across the screen. Nope, too late. Too late. Oh, well, I killed something. There we go. What's in here? Oh, here we go. Look out, baby. Here I come. Time for the deep fryer, th deep fryer trio. Shrimp. Here. Someone get the dip. Exactly. Give me some zesty sauce from Burger King. I got a long night ahead of me. Oh. And I, I don't know what this is. It's like a kebab of some kind. Chasing you. There we go. And he's dead. Got my points. Alright, so that's two of the bosses. I think there's three in each stage. If I had to guess. Oh, 
Oh, shit. No. Paula Jean would like that. Nah, I don't think she would. Not enough butter. She's gotta at least use a stick and a half on that stuff. That woman's trying to kill her husband. Nobody uses that much butter. Shots of vodka. We'll spit it out, man. There you go. Empty. Wow, I went all the way in there for nothing. There we go. Just two. Yeah, exactly. Kidding, I put two shots of vodka into my bot in my into my Mountain Dew when I get back from Taco Bell. Pours half the bottle in there. There you go. Crap, now what do, now what do I do? Shit, not what I wanted to hit. I'll take it though. Man, that thing takes a lot of hits. Oh, at least it gave me life that time. And more life. I forgot how long this stage is. Oh yeah, the wishing well. Time to do some damage. And it's dead. And I got more life. Cool. Makes your throat burn. Vodka, not so much. Vodka is actually pretty smooth, unless you're like getting like the really, really cheap shit. I forget when the flying eggplants actually even show up, Evie. stage of Darius, that old arcade shooter by Taito. It's got the same background almost. Empty. Oh, but there's something in here. Gonna put toothpaste on my phone. Actually, no, they weren't. I know, yeah, John Tron and his review thought they were eggplants, but they're actually like wisps or spirits. Just another cultural mistranslation. There we go. I get to keep my. 
my fabulous secret magic drugs a little while longer. Oh, that's right, the bull. Move it. Vomit. First time I ever drank, I ate a whole pan of Stouffer's mac and cheese at this party. Never vomited worse in my life. Uh, the worst for me, um, I'm pretty sure I've told. I don't know if I've ever told anybody this story, but, um, well, no. I'm sure I've told somebody, but anyway. New Year's Eve. I have a whole bunch of people over my house. This is like, God, almost 10 years ago now. Um, my legs are asleep. Oh yeah, the mummy. This music always creeps me out, I don't know why. Okay. So anyway, it was New Year's Eve, so we started drinking, I want to say around like 6 o'clock in the evening. And so we order a bunch of pizzas, and we go on this website called idrink.com, where it shows us how to make shots based on what we had in the house. So it started off pretty innocent, and then we just started getting more and more dangerous with our mixtures. Around 10 o'clock at night, a friend of mine, Alex, decides to just create a shot comprised of everything we had in the house. So he just starts pouring everything into this highball glass. And by the time he was done, it was solid black. So there was like tequila in there, scotch, whiskey. Like I think that we had like freaking blueberry schnapps and shit. I don't really remember what was in there. It just looked toxic. No light penetrated the liquid in that glass. Not at all. And so he goes to drink it. I swoop in out of nowhere, and I'm already pretty far gone by this point. Jesus had nothing to do with this, Evie. Anyway, so I snatch it out of his hand, and I'm about to drink it, and he goes, Bro, do you think that's a good idea? And me, being drunk, in the process of being drunk and stupid, just says, No, nah, man, it's fine, I can take this, and I down the entire contents of the glass. At 10.30 p.m., I sat down immediately afterwards and bit into a slice of pizza. That's when it hit me. And so I bolted towards my bathroom, and that's the last thing I remember before 11.55. I blacked out completely at 10.31 p.m. By 11.55, I woke up shivering in a fetal position on my bathroom floor. That was the drunkest I ever got, and I don't think I will ever get that way again. Because that was terrifying. I'll suck all your blood. Remember the prototype version of this game? This thing actually had a human face on its back. Pretty messed up. So yeah, I don't remember much of what happened, but my friends were all laughing at me like, dude, you are the loudest puker ever. Definitely not one of my proudest moments. But anyway, round four. Oh, that's right, the Egyptian... The catacombs. Scorpions. Alright, so I forget what's up here. Empty! I don't think those ones shoot anything. Dead. <laughs> I 
I almost did, Nicholas. I'm sure there's video on the internet. I'm sure somewhere on the internet there's a video of me from that party. Because I know my friends actually did take video, but I don't know if they ever posted it. I'm pretty sure there's like some phantom YouTube account somewhere. I am a slowpoke. Yeah, that's normally... I'm normally the same way. I'm like a sleep... I'm a sleepy drunk. Like, I just get tired really fast. Which... Depending on what crowd you're with is not necessarily a good thing. That's how you get, like, Sharpie drawn on your face. Sure enough, there it is. Yeah, it looks all it looks all cute and innocent now, but watch. Turns into this fucking hell beast. Thankfully it's easy to kill. Worst thing I ever had to drink was a smoker's cough. I'm almost terrified to find out what's in that. I'm assuming it's a mixed drink, am I right? Oh! Oh, that's disgusting. Jaeger and mayonnaise? It's almost like... It's almost like, Nicholas, have you ever heard of a Mexican hooker? It's very similar to that. Yeah, Jägermeister mayonnaise, right? A Mexican hooker is just basic, it's essentially tequila and uh, cottage cheese. Probably my favorite boss in the game right here. I just love the music for this guy. That's why sometimes I like to I like to hang out in that room after he's dead and just listen to the music. Done. 
See, that's 50% milk and 50% beer. Well, there's an Irish car bomb, which is basically a pint of Guinness, and you drop a shot of Bailey's in it. And you have to drink it before it turns. It's almost similar to a uh, uh, cement mixer. the Kim Jong-un nuclear bomb, Nick. fries, barbecue sauce, milkshake. Is there any liquor in this? I guess you just blend this all together? Sounds like a puree. A McDonald's apple pie. Okay, that sounds absolutely disgusting. With vodka. Oh, I'm already done. This sounds absolutely wretched. Like that's something you give a pledge in a fret in a fraternity. Like a cement mixer. And we're done. The McQuick fix. <laughs> sounds about right. Okay. pause for a second because I do not remember at all how to get through the stage. Okay, never mind. I got it. Is it raining outside? Hmm. All right, so I think I got this. More like McQuick death. Yeah, exactly. Oh, God. All right, so...
really easy to die in here. And this is the first part of this game I ever saw, was this stage. Yeah, it is, it's pouring outside. Okay, I know where I'm going now. Pants. That's pants. Walking around like Jacob Hoover on Tuesday afternoon. Okay, I can't do this. No, not because of Hurricane Lee. Hurricane Lee missed us. So did Maria. Those weird comet things. time which one this boss creeps me out Here's the right one they're like weird grinning faces if you ever saw their sprite they're just the stuff of nightmares boss in the stage, and this is the only one it needs, really. Got it. You're dead. Okay. So now I gotta go back to the bar. Ow. So now I'm back in O. Okay. How in the bloody blue blazes do I get out of here? Oh, I see. I see exactly how to get out of here. Okay, cool. Going back once I came. No. I don't know who Jake Paul is, and honestly, I don't want to know. Alright, so where am I going from here? Oh, wait, no. I'm going the wrong way. Great, I killed pants. Nice. 
nice. Yeah, I got apparently I got a few subscribers. Okay, we're on to stage seven. This thing. Dire need a health. Yes. Okay, I will. Come again. You give me bonus points. Oh, you can get... Come again. Oh, it's just giving me bonus points. Alright, let's keep going up. Yep. Entrance to hell. Oh, hello, Mr. Grim. Death is as much of a cheating bastard here as he is in Castlevania. Continue! Oh god, I hope this doesn't even have to fight Royce again. We gotta find a capsule or something. fight him again. Dead. 
You get infin infinite continues, thankfully. I can't get out of here. There's gotta be a strategy for this guy, I just don't know what it is. Okay. Alright, there's really is there really is no other strategy to this guy except strategy to this guy.
bastards, give me a capsule. I need my drugs. Not what I wanted. tired for this crap right now. So, with that being said, we're just going straight to the last stage. Because fuck this. I'm tired of dealing with that fucking tower. Watch out, baby. Thank <laughs> you. 
barely making it through here. remember this being this difficult. I honestly don't. that last hit. I'm too tired. I was hoping to go through this legit, but... It's one in the goddamn way. Tell me whatever you like. Okay, speaking of which. Oh shit, I'm about to... Is this the Mark Soup guy? No. 
No, it is not. Oh well. Whatever, onward! Yep, there he is. Yeah, I know, right? Thank you, Game Facts, for that one. <laughs> There are some games that do take you to the end credits. I know for a fact, uh, Alien 3 for the Super Nintendo. Just start mixing it up. Oh, I have the key already. Eat a dick. Now it's time for the ending. Bert gave him a gift. And Mark went home. He excitedly opened the box. And a beautiful princess came out. How the fuck did she God, I can breathe! passwords to win, but I don't care. I'm tired. But, uh... I think this is where I'm gonna end the stream for this Friday. Thank y'all for joining me. It's been a pleasure. And thanks you to those who, who uh, subscribed this evening. Don't know who you were because I wasn't checking OBS, but, um... Thank you all the same. Those of you who haven't yet, please like and subscribe our channel. 
trying to get to those 1,000 subs. Right now, we're struggling at about 220 or so. So, I will see you guys on Monday evening for the second half of Grave Chase. I'm looking forward to finishing that one. Anyways, thanks for joining me, and good night.